Told you, too open. <laughs> too open. in a building where they absolutely love college basketball. Are you pumped? I'm pumped. Yeah. Absolutely. I, I, I can feel it. This is what college basketball is all about. This, this is an NCAA tournament yes. game in waiting. And it feels like it as well. It, it really, really does. The opening tap is controlled to the Blue Jays and Mo Watson will begin it. Justin Patton, the red shirt freshman. His first season in the Big East with his son, Doug. They got all the way to the finals of the Big East tournament. Looking to get back into the NCAAs after a trip to the third round of the NIT a year ago. Foster. Plays. Shot clock is under six. Great work by the freshman, Patton. Watson on the loose. A step back for Foster. Nothing but nylon, and they are pumped in Omaha. And the foul to the goalie. The blow by, Showalter rejected. Do you see what makes this young man so special? Not only the block, but he was in position right here to help defense to negate what could have been an easy basket inside for Show Walter. Inside, the timing is impeccable right here by Payton. They get their feet underneath them. Watson again gets his hands in there. That's the fourth Badgers turnover. That's just excellent anticipation that time by Watson. Another one. Nothing but nylon. Zierden has also come in. Isaiah Zierden, a sharp shooting three-point man. Only got off one shot in 22 minutes action the other night in their win as Watson negotiates into the painted area and the dump down to Vito Brown and he turns it over again. This time it's Hanson that starts it. Zierden loves that spot on the floor, but Hayes is right in front of him. Hanson, he and Toby Hegner blew the think for 30 seconds. Zierden from up top. Hello, how do you do? This kid can get on a... To another level. Absolutely. Redefining the roles for both Nigel Hayes and Bronson Kinney was the key. Oh, oh. the iron kind to pull up. And that... 16 to 4 this run now. And that was offensive rebounding against the zone because you were able to break it down with the dribble. Beautiful alley -oop. And one. Watson with a Philly move gives it up to the big freshman and he flushes it home. But the beauty of it is Watson was able to get out of transition early against the defense that wasn't set. Now you have a rotation of half. That leaves the backside wide open for Patton to easy inside alley -oop. and now the shot. Oh, it misses everything. Lakin is about to get that one in. Billy Keenan has one field goal. How about that duck under by Foster? Again, attacking. Didn't that time able to absorb contact and finish. If you're the coach where they leave, you don't like it. But if you're the coach that accepts <laughs> great talent, you'd love to transfer. Watson from the seat of his pants. One of the most entertaining for Charlie Thomas. Non-shooters now, Jimmy, taking shots for Wisconsin. Watson. That's not a non-shooter. And, and again, in transition, you back the deep. These are games that are only going to help you with the tournament selection committee. Not hurt you. Hegner trying to stay with it. Hanson, he willed that one in. It's 31-30. Creighton has the lead again. ...though to the play of Hanson. Jack Hanson, the senior from South Dakota, getting quality minutes. Foster! Hammer time! in Omaha. Well, Foster's guard on guard, pick and roll. That time, the rotation was slow for Wisconsin getting back. But again, it's the penetration off the dribble, the lack of communication on the weak side. That allows now Foster to get it easy. Throw it down, young
the first half. Stone Cold. A lot of those shots were off of one pass. That one was on the ball. See Watson. Oh. There he is again. Electrifying. Absolutely. Yes and a foul. Seven nothing. Reminiscent of what we saw early in the first half. Creighton jumps out. Wisconsin settles in. Foster. Foster hits a team three. <laughs> what a trigger. 41. The ability not to panic when the shot clock is under five is a also trademark of this Wisconsin team. Irie Thomas off the feed from Watson. Dropping dimes on the field. Comes at point blank range. But it came off excellent ball movement. Oh, just as I say that, counted in a foul. And that's an example of Watson getting up and under twice and getting the end one. Quite an example, too, of Wisconsin. They can go 10 deep. You're right. And their guard play changes dramatically when Hill comes in for Trice and vice versa. A little bit longer on the perimeter. Haven't heard from Watson of late. Maybe time for him to call his own number. Huff on the wing. Mm. And you know what I love about that move? From the post players by Wisconsin again. Communication out there on the back line for great easy opportunity. Oh, he was up down to Patton. Mm. That's a beautiful bounce pass entry. Bounce pass. It feels like March to me. Patton. Oh, how smooth was that? Timeout. It is a great one at the Dave Gavitt tip-off. Bounce pass. Thomas working hard. Thomas goes up strong. Missed it. Pat no got the offensive board guy. stripped away, but into the hands of Watson. Outside for Hegner. One time, Wide Kobe. open three. One time. Boom! Yes, sir! Kobe Hegner finally knocks down a five points bank three-pointer. What a shot for the Wisconsin native against his home state team. Jays lead by five. 7.06 to go. Illa Kanan to Koenig, Koenig against Thomas, picked his pocket, back the other way, here comes Thomas, Thomas through the paint, Thomas layup, good, basket and one, Kyrie Thomas steals it, drives it, scores it, draws the foul. And that is a big time point guard that he just took his cookies and then to finish it through the contact, but you got to give some credit to both Maurice Watson and Justin Patton for keeping the previous possession alive so Hegner could knock down a three. But that is an amazing individual effort from Kyrie Thomas. Kyrie Thomas, 11 points. His first steal of the game. And another chance at a three-point in the play here. Cap underneath, throws up the layup, no good. Ball was taken away, but pulled back by the Jays. Here comes Watson, they want to run. Into the corner, Thomas catch and release three. Yeah. Bang, bang, bang! Take that! Taz on a five-point bank three-pointer. It's an 11-point lead. Timeout, right guard. And listen to him roar. Hanson. Oh, what a shot. And McDermott knew it. Did you see the reaction? Koenig, 39 seconds left. Koenig with Zierden on him. Will step back, take the three. It's off the heel, no good. Tip in the air. Pulled down by Kyrie Thomas. Thomas up ahead. Deep pass down the floor. Here comes Patton. Bang for the dunk. And that might do it with 27 seconds left. Here comes Happ into the front court. Happ. Got it picked away by Thomas, and here comes Thomas! Exclamation point! Woo! And a foul! Kyrie Thomas steals again, takes it down the floor, jams it home, and ices this ball game for the Creighton Blue Jays! And how about the two Omaha boys with the double exclamation points? Patton with the dunk. And Kyrie Thomas with the steal and dunk. It out, long three. It's in and out, no good. Ball tipped out with 11 seconds left. Koenig throws up a desperation three, no good. Rebound pulled down by the Jays. Down the floor to Watson, who catches under the basket and will dribble it out. Jays win. 
Jays win! Win! Creighton 79, Wisconsin 67! What a big early season win for the number 22 ranked team in the country as they knock off a top 10 rated foe.